at Christ's Tabernacle of Life Assemblies, Evangelist Nicholas Bonge, in his message titled Generosity in Giving, highlighting the benefit of giving, citing the widow that gave her best. Giving should be part of every individual, irrespective of their age, class, or one's level in the society. He enjoined believers to emulate their maker, who through his love for mankind, gave his only begotten son, who died to save the world. We give according to our ability. You will give according to the love you have. His love was shared abroad in our heart. And so we are to give because we love God. Evil people and mend your ways was the message preached by Pastor James Saji at Jesus Freedom Ministry. Pastor Sajin advised everyone that for the world to be a better place for us to live in, we must deviate from our evil ways and turn to God. Many pastors today, you can see, they are, uh, they are reaching their self where the people are getting poorer. Those are the evil people we are talking. If they can come out from their evil way and bring the people to the knowledge of God, you will see that the country will be a very good place for us to live. Guest preacher. Pastor A.B. Isaac Pomotu at Calvary Grace Power Ministries advised believers not to allow themselves to be deceived by false prophets. He said they should always study the word of God and seek him for direction. This was captured in his message titled, Men, Know Thy Ways. There are a lot of false doctrine that is going on in this our present generation. Every believer should be aware, who should be watchful. If you really want to go to heaven, don't believe to those doctrines. Prophet Ebimo Bowe Duba has charged Christians world over to pray without ceasing, stressing that it is only through prayers that the enemies can be defeated. He gave the church while preaching on household enemies at Storm of Fire Prophetic Ministries, aka Yahweh Family. Every believer should pray very well and anyone around you how to get rid of this thing, even someone employ your gate man, your cleaner, everybody, even your sales girls. As a leader, you need to pray with them. Sunday services was wrapped with praises. In Yenagua, Voke Bari, NTN News.